In this tutorial I'm going to give you some hints and tips on files on how to move them and what the differences between copy and move are and just basically some some tips to make your life a little bit easier. So first of all I'm going to make myself a new folder so if I right click anywhere on the desktop I get this drop down box and I can select new and folder. Now I can call this folder whatever I want I, I'm going to call it stuff press enter. Now let's just say for argument's sake um, I made a mistake I didn't want to call it stuff I want to call it my stuff so let's go back to the folder and right click on it and this time we're going to select rename and I'm going to type in my stuff that's better that's what I wanted to do so that's as easy and simple as it is to create a folder and name it. Now the next thing I want to do is I want to transfer some documents to it. Now the thing I tend to see people doing a lot is when they're selecting their documents to, to move or copy from one place to another they either select an area at the top left click and hold with the left mouse button and they drag everything down there until everything's highlighted and then they could move it sometimes I've seen people go from the bottom up and then this sort of thing happens and they don't quite get what, what, they're, what they're looking for so a real easy way to select all the files in a folder is click on any one of the files with the left mouse button and then on your keyboard hold the control button down and then press A and automatically that will select all the files in the folder so that's a real easy tip just control and A will select everything that's inside a folder now if I wanted to I could just with the right mouse button I could click and hold anywhere in the blue areas, drag it over to my stuff folder, let go and I've got two options here. I can either copy it here or I can move it here. Now if I copy it there I'm going to end up with a copy in my documents folder and I'm going to end up with an identical copy of the files in my stuff folder. Now if I was to select move I would actually be taking all of the documents and folders out of my documents folder and placing them in my stuff folder which may not be what you want to do but let's just say for argument's sake I don't want to move everything in my documents folder to my stuff folder I just want to move certain things so as we can see we still get everything highlighted in blue if I hold my control button down again and keep it held down whichever one I pick is going to turn back to white. Okay, so let's just eliminate some of these folders. I don't want the folders. Or well, maybe I want that one, and I want that one, and maybe I don't want that one, maybe I don't want that one, or that one. Um, and as for these, that's the only other one I don't want to move over. And then I left. I can let go of my control key now. And again, anywhere in the blue area, I can right click drag across, let go and I've got the, the choice of copy or move. So I'm going to go ahead and copy. And it's gone straight in there. If I open that up now I've got all of those folders and files that I selected that I wanted to move across. Okay that's as, that's as easy as it is. So control and A will select the whole contents of the folder that you're looking at and if you keep the control button pressed down you can flick through and pick out the ones that you either want to move or you don't want to move and if you make a mistake you can switch them on or off as you can see there so anything blue something's going to happen with it anything white it's not going to move at all I hope that was of some help to everybody and thanks very much for watching